Now today I'll discuss the difference between a static website and a blog and why a blog is very important to have if you plan on having a long-term business. A static website versus a blog. Now when you have a static website, that was very, very important years ago because everybody was kind of new to the internet. So everybody needed a website. You know, it kind of proves your validity. You know, it kind of shows everybody you're legit when you have a website. The first thing people say when they get your business card is, what's your website? Do you have a website? And now the internet is evolving and Google looks for content. So basically, yes, you can have a static website, but your competitors may have blogs. So that means this is the difference. You have a website, you got a five page site for an, for instance, and your website is sitting there. Uh, IamDaily.com for instance, my site, five page site just sitting there and I offer business services, you know, graphics, logos, things like that. And then my competitor is over here and they have a blog. They have a website and a blog. They might have a website, but they done got themselves a blog and attached their blog to it. So now with the blog, every day they write a post about their services. Um, one day they write it about business services. The second day they write it about logo design. Third day they write it about graphics. The fourth day they write it about printing. The fifth day they write it about something else. And then so 30 days from their one day, they got 30 different pieces of content on their website and I still got a five page blog. So somebody comes to Google and types in business services, who they gonna see first? The one with the most content related to the particular topic. So now I automatically done got left behind by my competitor because I have a static website which is just five pages and now they have 35 pages. They got their 30 pages for the month and then they got their five pages which was their static website. It's just, this is just scenarios. So now at the end of the year, you got 365 days in a year. If they wrote a blog a day, they got 365 pieces of content on their site every day, updating, updating, making it a point to update their site every day with keywords that relate to their business and I got a five page website still sitting here when somebody types in Google business services guess who gonna come to the top the page with the most relevant content that's how Google ranks us now Google don't just rank you just cause you done got on the internet they rank you because of your content and having related and having updated new fresh content but still relating to your topic. So that's why you need a blog if you're a business owner and you want to make long-term money. Eventually, once you write these blogs, you can share them on social media. You can get traffic to your pages from social media shares, and then that can help you rank. But if you don't have a blog, you can't hardly rank a website as good anymore because the internet is changing and Google are doing things different. So you need to be basically updating your site regularly, putting more and more content, making your site bigger and bigger by the day or by the week or every, you know, as often as you can, but you need a blog to do it. That's why you need a blog. So you can still have the website, but then you have to add a blog. You don't have to, you don't have to do nothing, but it's best to add a blog so that you can start updating your content regularly so you can start sliding to the top of Google with organic. You want organic searches. When people search, they type in logo design. You want I Am Daily to come up. My site, I, I Am Daily. You want I Am Daily to come up because you provide business services, but you have to do what it takes to make I Am Daily come to the top. You can't sit it there and think, oh, I got a website. People see me. People are not looking for you. They looking for your services. If they they not looking for I am daily, they never heard of I am daily. They looking for logo design. You want them to come up to the top when you logo design. 
Google, type in logo design. I want I am daily to come up for that. Not I am daily. They ain't nobody looking for I am daily. They don't know me. I want it to come up for graphics, business card printing, things like that. Advertising, banner designs. That's what. That's when you're doing something on the internet. You're not doing nothing just by having a website online. Just not anymore. It's not like that anymore. The internet is changing. It's going forward. It's progressing. So they want you to have content. Anybody can throw up a site today. That doesn't make them relevant. That doesn't make them legit. But if you continue to keep building on your site, you're becoming more and more relevant and more and more legit because you just keep on updating your site and you put in keywords and you building yourself for the future. That's what you do. Now, I hope you guys understood and I hope I made it very clear why you need a blog. And if you do need a blog, then holler at me. I can help you get set up with your blog today. Have a great one.